why do you think that it was important to be part of Ghana Fashion and Design Week? Okay, um, how it all started was in 2014, um, I won the new talent spot um, with Ghana Fashion Week. So from then, it's been like a challenging thing for me. So every year I try to come out with new things and it's been helpful because with the new talent spot, I've really gotten advice where I would have paid for it. I've gotten it for free. So I think it's something good. Yeah. How long have you been designing for? Um, I just graduated out of school in 2014. So uh, Tutuwa has been out for just two years. Yeah. Where did you study? <laughs> Radford University College in Ghana. And that school's been um, really uh, pumping out some really talented individuals. How do you feel being part of the group of the next generation of fashion people from Ghana? Um, I really feel privileged with the kind of lectures we have there. And um, it's, it's actually been a stepping stone for most of us because um, we see ourselves somewhere international designers upcoming and that's really good yeah <laughs> now have you always been interested in fashion like your whole life yes <laughs> yes at a point in time I diverted but I realized that I needed to come back to it so I came back <laughs> and what made you divert because I know that being an African a lot of times parents are not the most supportive <laughs> of creative fields is that what it was or well I think it was influence going to secondary school fashion wasn't um, an interesting thing to do so I think I went into science but I realized that fashion was my passion so I came back to it after high school yeah. uh, and who are some of the people that inspire you are there designers you look up to um, well I would always say everybody has his or her own unique style um, I put together one and two I don't really have people I look up to but I always challenge myself so I really um, don't have one particular designer I look up to I just look at my heritage and it inspires me to bring up more and where I'm coming from that I will be able to do something someday and make my nation proud so that's what inspires me where do you see African fashion going? Um, I think that it's going far because we have a beautiful heritage and if designers decide to come back using our own heritage, it will be something because now the um, Europeans are using what we have. So we have to know that we have something nice and we have to go back to it and use it. And so I think it's we are really going far if we only we can realize what we have and go back to it. Yeah. And what are some of the things about the culture that inspire you when you create your designs? Do um, you use some of the fabrics? Is it some of the styling? Okay, so for this year, I'm using our own traditional batik we have in Ghana. And it came from the inspiration of, my inspiration was the sea and the sunset. So I have a few colors from batik and um, which I dyed and used. And next year, I hope to move on to something more. So those are some of the things that inspired me so the fabric is unique and this is what I used but we have other techniques which I might be going into later on in life yeah now this is your older collection that's mm -hmm. here right now yes. um, that we're standing by mm -hmm. this is from last year the black that's what I call the blend collection is from last year and then the beige the earth colors are from my graduate collection yeah. this one um, I want to know about this one and why, because it's like a bandage, it's like yeah. a bandage kind of yeah. look and you yeah. see that in some of the designers from Europe and um, is this something, were you inspired by a certain designer you saw or was there just something about this that you thought would look fantastic on women? My inspiration for 2014, that was my graduate show, was um, death, strange, but um, I narrowed it down to Egyptian mummies. And you know Egyptian mummies are wrapped around with bandages, or they used to be wrapped around with bandages. So that was my main inspiration. So that's how come the skirt looks like um, bandaged skirt. Yeah. What are you looking most forward to this year? Um, fun. <laughs> because this collection, this 2017 collection, is fun. It's fun. Spirited beauty. Yeah. So fun. <laughs> yeah.